Each year, there are 20,000 life-threatening cervical injuries in the United States alone. Injuries that can lead to lifelong paralysis or death. According to the Department of Transportation, 25% of these cervical injuries occur because of movement after the initial trauma and are therefore preventable. The x collar offers the solution that will save lives and reduce the incidence of paralysis. The x collar and neck splint by Emma Gear. In this program, we're going to introduce the features and capabilities of the x collar the first cervical spinal splinting system designed for emergency care. The x collar splints the cervical spine above C1 and below C7 in the back, as well as in the front of the patient. Now in order to show how efficiently this device can be applied, we'll demonstrate its application in real time. First, the splint is adjusted symmetrically to maintain the patient's head in a neutral position. Then the length is adjusted to obtain optimum immobilization. Finally, the X straps are engaged to complete the system's application. When using other collars, size must be approximated before application, in contrast to the X collar, which is adjusted during application. We'll compare the difference in the range of motion between the X collar and the other collar. The other collars still allow movement in the cervical spinal region, whereas the X collar splints the head of the patient to her torso, minimizing movement. Also notice how the patient's ear is compromised by the other collars. The X collar is designed ergonomically to fit around the ears for faster and more secure application. Other collars are not able to secure a large patient's head in the neutral position. If this is the center of the spine, then the head of the patient is being pushed off alignment. The same happens when the device is applied to a small patient. If the center of the spine is here, then again, the patient's head is not maintained in proper alignment. With the X collar, regardless of the patient's size, you can secure the patient's head in proper symmetrical alignment. In cases where patients complain of pain upon movement and their head is not in the neutral position, the x collar gives the rescuer the ability to splint them in the position found, or the position of comfort. Notice how the chest piece can be adjusted asymmetrically, securing the head to the torso in the position of comfort. The adaptability of the design empowers rescuers to immobilize their patients in a multitude of positions allowing the patients to be transported with minimum manipulation. In the following scene, we will demonstrate the application of the X collar by a single rescuer to multiple patients in a simulated vehicle accident. In the case of a multiple casualty incident, the X collar allows rescuers to provide initial patient stabilization faster to multiple patients, requiring fewer personnel and less equipment. Commitment to the best patient care possible has resulted in the creation of the X collar. Clinical studies demonstrate that the X collar provides a more effective method for treatment of cervical spine injury by splinting the patient's head to the torso. If your neck or the neck of someone you love was on the line, wouldn't you choose the best possible technology available? In conclusion, this new device gives rescuers the ability to provide better patient care faster to multiple patients, requiring fewer personnel and less equipment. The X Collar and Neck Splint by Emma Gear. Now in use by members of the United States Special Operations Forces. In 2008, our innovative technology has been recognized with top awards from the leading emergency medicine publications Contact us now and take advantage of our free training program. Learn why EMS Magazine called the x collar truly a milestone in the evolution of cervical spine care. For more information, visit us at www.xcollar.com.